welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, I'm Sabrina. I create hair care, beauty, and lifestyle content. If any of those interest you or if you like what you see in this video, then definitely make sure you subscribe. If you are not new to this, but you are true to this, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for all of your love and continued support. So today I am here, hair. <laughs> I am here with a hair rehab wash day for you guys. I know my natural hair care videos have been missing in action, but I'm gonna let y'all know why once we get into this video. But really quick, I wanted to share with you guys this beautiful bouquet of Forever Rose that I just got. So this is from Rose Forever. They are a New York based company. And if you guys are hit to the rose game that you know that these like forever rose bouquets have been floating around and basically they are real flowers real roses that well this specific one can last for up to a year they are treated with essential oils they are handcrafted in your bouquet so literally every bouquet like comes to you like perfectly orchestrated and all of that it's so gorgeous and i love it so i decided to get the black ensemble they have i think it's either black or white they have a few colors that you can get your base in and they actually literally have like i think over 20 colors of roses that you can get so whatever color like your person is into whatever their favorite color is you can get it they even have gold you guys they have gold roses <laughs> but I love minimal, like I love a minimalistic look. I like, I wanted something that would be able to go with my decor no matter what I decide to go with. Right now I'm really into like the boho vibe. So I figured a very nice, sleek black and white look will go well with my decor and it is. So these are the roses in the bouquet. Again, they are like perfectly handcrafted so beautiful i got i believe i got ivory i didn't get white i didn't want it to be too stark white i didn't want it to look too fake <laughs> so these are what the roses look like they're so pretty and the case is velvet i believe yeah so friggin cute i do have a discount code if any special occasion is coming up or if you just want to treat the special person in your life or if you want your special person to treat you in your life be like oh hey babe and they got a coupon code, you know, hook, hook them up, do them a little discount. So I will leave the discount code on the screen and also in the description box. So definitely make sure you check them out. I'm loving them. Thank you so much for Rose for my bouquet. I have been loving them. And I got them like the week of Mother's Day. So I felt a little special. I did. <laughs> okay, guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this wash day slash styling video. Yeah. <laughs> so today I'm here with a hair care video. And I know I have not done one of these in so long. Explanation <laughs> to my natural hair, straight hair, natural community. I'm sorry, but for the past eight months, I have literally been testing out different formulations of product. If you know, then I do have a hair care line that I am expanding and it's coming, it's coming sooner than you think. But yeah, for eight months, I have been testing out products, like different formulations of product. I've been in my hair so much. So once that process was done, <laughs> when I say I was so over my hair, I did not want to touch it. I didn't want to do it. I didn't want to see it. If you know, you know you know if you felt that then you understand but it's that time I have neglected my hair enough and I need like my hair needs a whole hair rehab day okay and when I say that the typical wash days it's just it, it's not cutting it okay like my hair deserves a spa day my hair has been manipulated beyond this world okay <laughs> for the past eight months trying out these products and then after I done manipulated it, harassed it, I threw it up and neglected it. Like it's been through some things and I want to show it that I love her and I'm so happy that she's been a trooper through this because you know, we are Blue Bunny certified over here. We don't test on animals, honey, but we test on me. <laughs> I'm the tester. 
So when I have moments like this where my hair like severely needs a reset, I love DIY natural treatment. First, we are going to make the DIY treatment. So I'm gonna show you guys everything that I'm gonna put in mine and it's jam packed with goodness. Okay guys, so we're getting ready to make the mask and you see I have some ingredients here. So the first ingredient I'm using is an egg. So eggs are very rich in vitamin A, E, and biotin and folate. So the egg is really good to make your hair thicker and healthier and it has moisturizing benefits and it also is going to be great for shine. So the next ingredient that I'm going to use is a banana. So bananas are very high in potassium and other vitamins. It helps with hair elasticity. It moisturizes your scalp. It can help prevent dandruff. It protects against split ends and breakage. So I'm going to use a whole banana and this is going to make more than I need but what I'm actually going to do with the remainder is freeze it for the next time. So the next ingredients I'm using is an avocado. You don't need two. I'm only using these two because they're literally on their way out and I would rather use them than throw them away. But avocados are filled with biotin, vitamin B and E. It protects and strengthens your hair. It locks in moisture in your hair cells and it strengthens your hair roots, shaft and strands. Okay, so next I'm going to add some oil. Now this is an oil blend. <laughs> so this is an oil blend. This was actually a tester for a new oil that I will be um, launching as well. But this one didn't make it to the cut because it's amazing. This oil is amazing. But the smell because of one of the ingredients, you guys wouldn't want to leave your house with this <laughs> in your hair but it's amazing but don't worry the update and the one that will be launched the smell is not a factor but it's just as amazing so you can use whatever oils you have this is an air verdict blend of oils so again i am making enough for two masks so if i'm gonna be honest you're just gonna put all this in there this is about this is four ounces of oil again i am making enough for two masks you don't have to use that much oil and then after that, you will just blend this goodness up. I probably should have put two eggs, but it's okay. So this is what the treatment looks like. Like literally it's thick, it's creamy. It's literally the, con the consistency of a conditioner. It's not liquidy, it's not watery, none of the above. Okay guys, so I'm going to scoop out about half of this enough to do my hair um yeah i'm just gonna do like half and half so i'm gonna put half in this little bowl to apply to my hair now and i'm gonna put the other half in a ziploc and freeze it for next time Okay guys, so we are back. We are in the bathroom ready to apply. And yeah, I'm going to shampoo after I apply this treatment just because it is food items and that just don't sit well with me <laughs> with just rinsing it out and putting a conditioner on. I need, I need soap. I need to make sure all the little residues that need to be out is out. And you know, your girl's hair don't smell like a trash can in a few days you know what i'm saying but you do as you wish Whew, it feels so good um and today i'm also going to do a slick bun tutorial it's gonna be a little bun i have a follower on instagram and i can't remember her name but baby girl been asking me for a slick bun tutorial for i don't know how long and i have yet to deliver for her if you was watching this Hey sis, sorry sis, I'm here. <laughs> I'm doing it today, I'm doing it today. Usually I do a very high bun, but lately I've been like into the low bun look. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so I do have my water mister here um, to 
make applying this a lot easier. It's gonna help open up my hair cuticles, my hair shafts and all of that so it can actually really receive the product. Um, so part of washing your hair, obviously you wanna cleanse your hair of products that's on it, but also the water um, makes your hair receive the products a lot better. Okay, so right now I'm going in and removing like, you know, any shedded hairs and things like that before we go in with this treatment, before we go in to wash any of that. So, now this is the shedded hair that came out. Not excessive, you know? We, have, we haven't been abusing her too much. <laughs> and I'm just gonna split this in half. And you know the drill, we are literally going to apply this as conditioner and ugh, it's so creamy and we are getting this all up on the scalp okay this is not just for the hair strands like this is a spa day for your hair your scalp everywhere gets this goodness okay like all of this natural ingredients no fillers no nothing straight from mother earth like yes we want everywhere to feel this goodness so you wanna make sure you definitely get it on the scalp so you can get the dandruff property, you can moisturize your scalp if you have dry scalp issues, any issues really, yes. And then I'm gonna put it on my hair strands. So, uh, quick little slight unofficial length check. My ends do need a trim. I do feel like I'm gonna end up cutting like two inches off of my hair by the time I do straighten it, but unofficial length check. This is what it's looking like. Okay guys, so I'm done applying all of the treatment in my hair and I have it all up in sections. So um, I ran out of my deep conditioning cap, so <laughs> good old plastic bag. I'm gonna put this on and um, I'm gonna let this sit on for about 30 minutes, probably a little bit more because I'm gonna do some dishes. Okay, you guys, so I'm fresh out the shower. Oh, moisturized. <laughs> um, so now we're gonna get into this sleek, slick bun. I love doing my buns on freshly washed hair. It's just easier, especially if you have a lot of hair. I have fine hair, but I have a lot of hair. So if you got thick hair and a lot of hair, girl, <laughs> your bun needs to be done on freshly washed hair. So this is my hair fresh out. It feels so good to have clean hair. I cannot wait to straighten my hair and give myself a trim. I have like about five, hold up. Okay, I have like about like five inches or so of hair. It's gonna look super crazy now because my hair is not even straightened so you can't even see the full effect. But yeah, like I already know like all of this is gonna be gone when I do my hair. But first and foremost, my hair is gonna be up in a bun until the next time we wash our hair. So, um, you know the drill, I'm gonna go in with my Simply Hair Growth Oil, which is my hair growth oil to moisturize my scalp and for some hair growth, okay? Trying to be Pocahontas up in here. Like, I don't know what my obsession is with long hair. She may have something to do with it. I love it. I just, I love long hair. I love it, I love it, I love it. I love it. So I am using the Bioterra Ultra Moisturizing Leave-In Conditioner. This is an OG of mine. 
And I'm gonna use, oh! <laughs> I just, I just spilled, not a lot, but I spilled enough to make it a mess. Still need more than this though. So I have about this much product. I need to turn the lighting down on my camera because I feel like you guys can't really see. Um, but yeah, I have this much and I'm gonna put it all throughout my hair to keep my hair moisturized while it's in this bun. I hear a lot of people talk about, you know, their hair doesn't really do good and like protect their styles or stuff or their hair doesn't grow or they get a lot of breakage and like things like that. And I also feel like it's because a lot of people don't properly like prep their hair to be in a protective style. So that's in there, hair is moisturized, but I'm not gonna stop there. I'm actually gonna go in with my Lotta Body and this is their coconut and shea oils. What is this? Moisturize Me Milk Curl and Style Milk. And I love this because it's super thick. And this actually kind of acts as a sealant to the moisturizer that I just put in, because that one is very like water-based, the Bioterra one. So I kind of put this on top to kind of like seal that one in. Okay, you guys, so I decided to do a voiceover for this section because it was going to make the video way too long if I explained as I went along. So I am sectioning my hair into like a half up, half down section so I can get the sleekest bun. And I use this brush to just brush out the roots to make sure that it's very sleek or slick. And then I'm just going to gel the perimeter of that down. I am using a hard bristle brush to get that as sleek as possible. And then I'm going to put that up in a ponytail. I was explaining that the hair ties that I use are like the stocking ones they don't have any clamps or anything so they didn't cause like extra breakage and once I have that section up I'm going to braid my hair so it doesn't get tangled and get out of the way I just want to turn my AC on because it was hot <laughs> and now I'm going to start working on the front and I'm using that brush to again like sleek out the the roots of the hair to get it as slick as possible and while I apply the gel then I go in with that same hard bristle brush to smooth it out and it's just going to be like a constant repetitive thing with the smoothest you're just going to keep going until you think you got it as smooth as possible and then I'm just going to join that in with the bun that I already have in the back and this is so much easier than just trying to put your hair in one section bun after that, I just go back in with some more gel because the more gel, the more sleek. We know what it is. <laughs> and then after that, I take out that braid and then I actually just do a twist and wrap that up in a bun and then just use another hair tie to secure it. So now I'm going in with my edge booster. Um, you know, the, the edge thing. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and I'm going to do my edges. Um, and I actually apply some on my actual hair too and brush it back with my edge brush and this definitely does help with that sleek look it really does so apply some edge control on top of your gel before you like slick everything down i'm then gonna go in with the um well, you know that what that is the gorilla is that gorilla that's not gorilla that's not gorilla <laughs> <laughs> that got to be glued free spray i freeze that on my hair and then hey guys I so it is the next day and i want to come back to show you the result of my sleek bun so this is what it's looking like obviously after my makeup i just had to touch up my edges a little bit and you'll do that throughout the week you know after washing your face i go to the gym so after sweating it out like when you want to go out that is literally all i would have to do is just touch up my edges but for other than that this is the bun. I don't know what my bun bun look like, but it's okay. But this is what it's like, like, girl, flat, <laughs> flat, flat, sleek, like, I love it. So on wash days that I'm like going for a bun, it's like bloop, 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 done. Like I'm set until next wash day. I love it. I'm loving it. <laughs> it's the sleekness for me. So when I want like a very no hassle wash day, you guys, this is this is what I'm going for. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you did. If you have not already, make sure you subscribe for nor more. Nor. Probably don't even want to subscribe now. She can't talk. <laughs> subscribe for more videos. And until next time, bye loves.